excuse me. Oh, wow, you again? Please interview me. I will come back a fifth time. I believe you. Um, uh, Rachel Stevens, for your consideration. I remember. Look, um, you know what an elevator pitch is? Yes, an elevator pitch is when um, there's... You got 30 seconds to impress me. Go. Uh, I, I graduated top of my class at Ryerson University. I was the sole TA selected for overseas news documentation in Afghanistan. I recently interned at the Toronto Sun. Breathe, Sank. breathe. It's okay. What would you do for us here at the Star? I would take photos nobody's ever seen before. That's kind of the point. What I mean is, um, just your younger demographics tuning out, and they should. You take last week's photo feature on chicken wing resources? <laughs> that was awful. That was my feature. Oh, uh, I'm sorry, it was awful. I'm kind of sexist. So, Rachel, <laughs> tell me, what will you bring to the Etobicoke Press? <laughs> Readers? Damn it. It's fabulous Friday. So, she wants to be famous. I don't need no help or get down. You didn't even get felines online? What did you say this time? Nothing. Okay, it was weird. You reminded me of my dad. Look, I wish you'd at least consider my idea. Harper, we have been through this. I am a photo journalist. I'm not gonna sell out to take pictures of Canadian celebrities for an entertainment tabloid. I have morals. You took Bridget's headshots. But that was so different. Oh, she made me kale chips and did my makeup for like an entire week. And Rach, I've never met anyone as talented as you. <sighs> yes, you suck at getting hired, but your photos make your 2,000 subscribers want to metaphorically kiss you. Whatever you sell, they buy, and there's a lot of money to be made here. No, Harper, there is money to be made down there. Canadian stars migrate south. Then give them a reason not to. You need a niche, Canada needs a star system, why don't we make it? <gasps> oh, crap! What, are you lost in the 80s? Whoa! Okay, this is about an 11 on the uptight scale. What? Is this about Bridget going to LA for the TV show? No, I am totally fine with losing my best friend and my roommate and her rent. Rachel! <sighs> Who finally showed up? Oh, what you got there? Oh, um, I'm trying to quit. Yeah, no, no, I, I wouldn't actually bother quitting because you're fired. What? Yeah. Fired? Yeah, yeah. I can't. I'm five minutes late. No, you are 35 minutes late. Okay. Whatever it is, I don't want to deal with it. I, don't, I can't deal with it. I can't deal with you. Just go. Please, go. Just go. I can't deal with it. My cigarette, Dick. Dick. Richard. I'll have a triple of your finest, least expensive bourbon. She'll have a coffee and... Water. A lot of vodka in there. Triple? David, it's 11 a.m. You have a problem. Obviously, I don't have a drink yet. I'm gonna die a broke old cat lady. <coughs> what in the name of God is that? And why is it so hot? Seriously, there are gonna be celebrities and fly honeys up in here tonight. I can't be serving drop shots from Satan's scrotum. For the last time, is that an afro? Casey Williams? It's Rachel from Canterbury. Wow! You got tall. Because you used to be, ooh, but now you're... Tall. Yeah. <laughs> I heard you inherited, inherited my dad's, dad's company. company. Yeah, it's awesome. Wow. Are you still, uh... A nerd with a camera. Yes, I am. I love it. Yes! My mouth is dancing. Come here, Seth Rogen. Give me a kiss. All right, well, I gotta run, but I'm having a dope party here tonight. It's gonna be a who's who of Canadian celebs. You should come. The year picture thing. Oh, it's called photo journalism. She'll be there. I love it. And don't forget, light the smother up. It's all about presentation, Chewy. Guys, no. I have better things to do with my time than party you. with a bunch of celebrities who probably just want to get drunk and have sex. Yeah, that's so uninteresting. Agreed. You know what? I think I'm just going to stay home, take a bunch of selfies. I don't I don't take selfies because they're hmm? lame.
photos. I mean, her bush looks like the bartender's afro, but whatever. Excuse me. Classy party, right? I tend to attract a certain clientele. Look, I saw the photos on your news feed. Do you know how much potential you have? Potential. Wow. Ah, oh, four years of school and I'm back to potential. Rachel, you're effing talented and you have a following. You need to go legit. I am legit. Blogs are legit. No, no. Money is legit. And my black card is signed by God. So what do you want? Well, I want people to stop telling me that what I do isn't legit. I want people to acknowledge that what I do actually matters. I want... I need to put you on the red carpet at the film festival. Are my words going through you? Rachel, you want to do something that matters? Take photos of people that matter. Look, I can tell by your camera, by the way you dress, just you in general, you don't have money, so you need me. Casey, I don't need anything from you. I'm going to get a drink. Wait, wait. You want me to buy it for you? Vodka soda, please. Are, are you Shannon Cook? You were in that new Saw movie. Or, no, um, Insidious. It's um, the same director, yeah. I'm Rachel. I loved you in Degrassi. I appreciate that. <clears throat> Sorry, this is my auntie, Carrie Lynn. Oh, hello. Promise to show her around, you know, the life. Pretty overwhelming, isn't it? Um, would you guys mind, mind if I took a photo of you? It's for Casey. Sure. Sure. Bye. No, we don't accept that, but there's an ATM over there in the corner, okay? Go find it. Wow, I can't even afford a $5 drink. Confirmed. She legit did time as a call girl like 10 years ago. What? Yeah, and Shannon's up for the lead in the new James Cameron film. Best party ever! <laughs> No! It's 23,000 now! I see you standing in the street You don't have anywhere to be They say stand up I'll put your hand 